Action News Now Storm Tracker Weather. Coverage you can count on. Wow. That's, what else can you say when you see a beautiful shot of Mount Shasta like that? I don't know if the winds are blowing up there. Doesn't really matter. Just stare at that beautiful scene. Yeah, really pretty looking outside. Chief Meteorologist Jason Stiff with us now. But Jason, it was a nice day for me looking out the window. But for those people who are out and about in it, not, not so fun. Yeah, it was a lot of wind today. It was even really windy before the sun came up today. It was windy late last night. I can hear the windows rattling. We had plenty of afternoon wind, and we still have a little bit more in the forecast for us around the valley as well as the mountains. We still have the same wind advisory for the valley that's been in effect since yesterday until 8 o'clock tonight. More wind gusts between 35 and 45 miles an hour possible, but an additional wind advisory has been issued for the mountains. That begins tonight at 8 o'clock and lasts through 11 o'clock tomorrow morning. And those higher elevations, the canyons also, some wind gusts up to 60 miles an hour will be a possibility, so keep that in mind. Now, we already have that wind still blowing around the valley. A lot of places between 15 and 25 miles an hour, but in Red Bluff, sustained at 25, still gusting to 37 miles an hour, so quite windy in Tehama County. Also very mild, seasonably mild. It's currently 66 degrees in Red Bluff at 65 degrees in Redding, up to 68 degrees right now in Chico, and 59 degrees, a mild and gusty day in Paradise. We haven't had a lot of cloud cover around the region, but that will change tomorrow also as yet another storm starts to move our way. So Wednesday morning, we're going to begin the day partly to mostly cloudy. There are going to be a lot of high clouds, and we're not going to have any good chance for rain or snow from those. We'll have a slight chance slight chance for some showers in the highest elevations, a little bit of rain, a little bit of snow late Wednesday into Thursday as this next storm in this train of storms moves overhead. But I guarantee you we're going to feel the effects of the wind more than any rain or snow going forward. So another windy day on Thursday with decreasing clouds. Then Friday and Saturday, completely different weather pattern for us. We're going to have a lot more sunshine and much warmer weather between 10 and 15 degrees warmer than average. Then a third storm. Just like the last two, moving our way late Sunday into Monday, a slight chance yet again of some high elevation snow and rain. But again, we're going to have breezes late Sunday and windier weather on Monday. And we can see some of that in our future cast for the wind. We'll have more of that wind gusts all the way through this evening for the mountains as well as the valley by 11 p.m., mainly between 20 and 25 miles an hour. Some higher gusts possible, but the windier weather is going to be reserved for the Southern Cascades as well as the Sierra. That will pick up tomorrow afternoon and then as we get into Thursday it's going to pick up again for the valley and for most locations windy weather as that second storm moves our direction so we are not done with this wind I wish we had good chances for rain or snow but outside of isolated showers it's just not in our forecast all the way into early April for tomorrow we we'll have some high clouds over the northern mountains breezy but also mild with highs in the 50s and 60s for northeastern California we'll have lows tonight in the 20s and lower 30s highs though a little bit milder mainly 50s it's still going to be a gusty day, especially in the foothills and in the mountains themselves. Also gusty tonight and tomorrow for the ridge. Lows in the 30s and lower 40s. Highs between 50 and 60 from Butte Meadows all the way to Paradise. For the valley tonight, we'll have a clear late night and then a partly cloudy morning. Lows most in the 40s. Not as windy, but it'll still be breezy. And then tomorrow afternoon, slightly warmer than today. Upper 60s and lower 70s with the breezes continuing, but it's going to be windier again on Thursday. Then we head to the Chico area. Lows tonight in the upper 30s and lower 40s under a partly cloudy sky by sunrise. Highs tomorrow afternoon. Also in the upper 60s and lower 70s. Breezy tomorrow, but windier for Chico on Thursday. Then look at this coming weekend. Enjoy this. We'll have a lot of sunshine. Highs way above average. Mid to upper 70s for Chico from Saturday through next Tuesday. For Redding, expecting lower 70s tomorrow. Windier and cooler on Thursday. Then after that, we really rebound. 75 to 80 degrees Friday through next Tuesday. A popular brewery.